before dinner, somebody may have gotten a little in trouble. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're in our oasis. Do people with campers do something cool? Find a monkey in the tree! <laughs> Jackson wants to know why he loves rocks. <laughs> I said, I don't know. You just do. Do you still like rocks? I love golden rocks. Golden rocks. We're gonna go on an adventure today. I love golden poo rocks. Golden poo rocks? No, golden blue rocks. Oh, I could have sworn you said poo. You said golden blue. <laughs> We're just waiting on Calvin to wake up and then we are going. Good morning, Calvin. Uh, you ready to go? Yeah. Okay, let's do a little roll call. Big dog? Check. Doggy blanket? Check. Little dog? Check. I think you're all set to go. You got everything? I've got my Jack's got his. Let's go! Let's go! Yeah, we got one more person. We'll get all these people loaded and we'll bring our favorite Penny. We can't forget Penny. That's the other roll call. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go! We're saluting every camper that we drive by. Did he say hi? Yeah, he did. <laughs> he gave me a little peace sign. Well, I was just thinking, you know, I gave that guy a little a, a salute because he was, you know, he had a trailer too. Motorcycles, when they see each other pass on the road, they like do a little, you know, a little hand wave. Subarus, when they see each other on the road, they do a little gesture to each other like, hey, you're driving the Subaru, you're cool too. Do people with campers do something cool? Do people with Teslas do something cool? Like, am I missing out on being in this exclusive hand gesture group? You're gonna have to look at your Facebook group that you're a part of now. I will, I will have to look at them. <laughs> So we have an expandable trailer, so the beds pop out. Jerry's told me this probably like a hundred times, just so I think he laugh. should probably tell you. It just makes me laugh. But, you know, sometimes it can get cold or you don't have a lot of people that you're traveling with, so you don't have to fold the beds out, you can just use the beds on the inside. And they call that turtling. <laughs> Get it? Because the turtle heads and tail aren't cut there, they don't pop out. They're That's turtling. Cute. They're turtling. Okay. Oh, stretch those legs, Miss Penny. <laughs> You've been the best passenger ever. <laughs> Let's go. You want some water? I got some nice cold water for you. Let's go. So this is a trip that we are taking the whole fam family on. We've got Penny with us and we have some fun things scheduled to take Penny and the kids on. We wanted to get out into the nature and wilderness. Well, I mean, I guess as far as the nature goes where we're going, it's not the most scenic place, but it's a wonderful place for kids and family and dogs. So we're really excited to take Penny with us on this trip because I feel like she's been missing out a little bit. She's sniffing poo right now. She's not really missing out on what she wants. So this is what she wants to do right now. Smell other dog's poo. It's kind of, kind of weird, I guess. Traveling with kids. Whether it's luxury or not, can sometimes be a little stressful. Calvin, at the very last minute walking out the house, I was like, we should grab his potty because he's really good to go to the bathroom at our house on our toilets. But when we're out and about, he's very hesitant and especially toilets that automatically flush. Oh boy, no. Mm -mm. And so I just went in the bathroom. Ja I went, Jackson went, and then it was Calvin's turn and he just, ah! and I was like, okay, let's go use your potty. It's in the car and he, Willingly, thank you very much, he used his potty, so I'm really glad we brought it, but like I said, sometimes it's traveling with kids, that's what you do. You bring their potties, you bring what they need, you bring the stuff to clean it out. But I'm proud of you, good job. Mm -hmm. And someday you won't be scared of it, huh? Mm -hmm. It's just kind of loud right now. Does it go mm -hmm. Next time will you try it? I uh, know. Nope. <laughs> Very honest. The fun thing about driving in the middle of nowhere when no cars are around. 
You can our, horn to the music. Our horn almost is almost exactly on pitch with that note. <laughs> Not anymore because the key change, obviously. <laughs> but you know what I mean. <laughs> Calvin's asleep. Penny's asleep. Hi, Jackson. What are you eating? Peanuts. The jet, Dad. What do you see? The jet. Oh, jet. That's cool. Famous Jet Jackson was up there. Hey, you know that hill up ahead? The really, really steep one up there. I feel like we're gonna need to fill up on gas when we're done. <laughs> Probably right after that. Look at that beautiful scenery. That is behind us. Welcome to the land of no snow. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good to not be where any snow is right now? I found a monkey in the tree! <laughs> a scared tree. monkey! Yeah, scared monkey! Go? Yay! You caught the monkey! Let's Look, keep him! I found a spider now! Look at you, Spidey! Woohoo! Nice work! We're here. We're in heaven. We're in our oasis. <laughs> Let me show you the coolest part. But I've got to hurry because we've got kids in the car that we need to get out because they are anxious. I am ready too. Check that out. There's the pool. There's a putting course. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> Maybe tomorrow we can get in it okay? I think it's back there somewhere. <gasps> cool, huh? Okay, let's go get Penny in our bikes. That's your bed, Cal. Do you like your bed? Yeah, it's warm. It's warm? <laughs> One, two, three, up. Oh, there you go. What do you think? Okay. It's good? <laughs> of a long, long travel day. <laughs> Penny is getting some much needed running time in and we are hitting the hay. The kids are set up over here. Our bathroom is set up right here. It's been a long time since we showed you guys. Our fridge is nice and full. I pre-cooked a bunch of food in there. So we are all set to go for food, Jared and I over there. The first day is always a little crazy. The kids are spent, Penny is spent, mom and dad are spent. Jared's finishing up his walk. I just got a little dinner ready, super easy. I just pre-made, I just pre-cooked some ground beef before I came and we're having like nacho salad, nacho tacos in a bag, super easy. Super yummy, the kids are just loving their chips. We are newbies still. There are like five fires, not actual fires, but like, you know, fires that I'm putting out. <laughs> trying to get things figured out. Penny is right here, right now. She may or may not have dinner tonight. I will get her dinner tonight, don't worry. But anyway, as I was getting everything solved and figured out, mom told me that you kids said a good prayer. What did you say in your prayer tonight? I did a beautiful one. You did a beautiful one? A beautiful song. <laughs> My song was like this. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's a good prayer. Okay. I'm, I'm going to ask mom in a second. Good night. We, night, we have. Oh. <laughs> We have such a fun adventure for the next yeah. couple days. So we it's need to go. And it's been that. Yeah. I can define a golden rock for me. I think that sounds like a great I idea. Go, so we're going to have a lot of fun tomorrow. That means we need to go to bed tonight and get some sleep, okay? Yep. Yeah. So will you boys lay down on your beds? Um, uh, why are you going to leave mom? Because that's where daddy sleeps. Why is a penny down there. Well, because that's where Penny sleeps. Okay, lay in your beds and we'll say goodnight to our friends, okay? Lay down. Night, friends. <laughs> Night, friends. Night. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Do you? No. 
Um, before dinner, somebody may have gotten a little in trouble. Um, just sassiness, um, a four year old was going on and they talked to Jackson about it and he got in trouble. And when he was saying his prayers, he was so cute and he was like, and I will be good to my mother tomorrow. <laughs> he literally was like, you are so cute, my mother. I, was just, I never refer to myself as mother. I just thought it was really cute. I'm really glad to hear them laughing. We are going to say goodnight, and I can't wait to take everyone on an adventure tomorrow. Today, it was getting here. We were driving, what, nine hours, plenty of stops for everyone. Everyone's just like ready to conk, except those two. Good grief. Okay, see you tomorrow, guys. Bye.